Florida State hosted rival Florida here at home today, but just weren't able to fall into a groove. The Knolls fought until the end, but only scored one run, which wasn't enough to give them the lead, falling 5-1 to one to the Gators. Anytime you get an opportunity to play the defending national champions, uh, it's a um, pretty awesome in the atmosphere, and we expected that, and uh, it was great to see the crowd out here tonight. And Lauren threw a great game. Lauren Hager's a, a great competitor in the circle, and she threw a great game attacking the zone. And um, I thought it was pretty awesome that... Um, you know, we were in to the very last at bats. You know, who else do you want to play? But Maddie O'Brien, and we were there for you know one swing to, to get something going. So I love the fight. Um, things were a little bit different by throwing Bailey, Jessica, and Karina. You know, try to change things up a little bit. And I liked how they responded and to the game plan. So um, you know, when you come, you, you don't get many games like this to get a measuring stick of top five and where you stand. And um, I think that we're just going to continue to grow as a program, and especially all our young freshmen to, to get that opportunity and feel it was, it was a really good day for us. I think we're in a really good spot as a team right now. Uh, I think we're gaining confidence and a lot of other players stepping up for us and so this weekend's going to be another one where you don't know a lot about the team you don't know a lot about what's going to be with uh, the facilities all that kind of stuff so we got to go in and, and jump in and this is who we are and how we're going to play and learn as we go along and so um, I think it's another great uh, situation for us uh, you know sometimes the more adversity you can get as a team and keep your head above the water the better we're going to be in the end so we're really excited for it. Up next and I'll travel to Louisville Kentucky for a three-game series against the Cardinals starting this Saturday. Make sure to stay tuned with Seminoles.com for all your softball coverage and highlights. Reporting for Seminoles.com, I'm Tanya Haneo.